guys, it's your girl Oyatoro. Welcome to another episode. I'm really excited to be talking about briefs and on True Story stalled briefing cases because I just didn't know how to. And um, I just want to answer whether or not you should brief cases, how you should brief, how you should brief your, brief your cases when you're reading in class and preparing for class. To be honest, there is no perfect way of briefing cases. Like I feel like I've been coming on, um, I've been coming on my videos and really telling you that there's not one way to do things because there's not one way to do things. It's just people have different styles and you have to figure out which one works for you. So on the matter of briefing, that also applies that there's not way, one way to brief. But what does a brief typically consist of? It consists of the issues, it consists of the fact of the case, it consists of the rule, the holding, arguments for and arguments against. Um, sometimes if you have a dissent, which is basically the minority opinion. That's what a brief would should look like. But the truth is that there's just some cases where you don't have to do every single step. Some cases will require you just stating what the fact is in one statement um, or state and stating what the rule is and also just stating the holding and a short really explanation why you don't really have to go into detail for each in classes where I've they found that you really have to be very meticulous as to like like you answering every single one of them I think contract is one of those classes that really requires you to kind of check all the boxes with with things that are on the brief. As far as, as far as like torts and like some of the other classes, it's just more important that you know what like just short summaries of what the what the issue is, what the fact is, um, and then you know what the holding is usually, and then you also just put like just a brief description. I mean, when you get comfortable doing that and just summarizing things very short and concise, you're able to. Um, not only retain better but like get the full picture quickly so um, yeah so that's really what briefs are uh, don't sweat briefs they're really not as bad as you think they are it's really just breaking it down I'm reading a chunk of words what can I just say about everything I've read they usually typically go into your outline they tend to be the cases that help with the the black letter law but that's that's all i have for briefs um if i miss anything in explaining briefs please leave it in the comments below i do want to hear what people have to say about briefing whether they brief through their through law school or make whether they did not and again thank you guys for watching my video and please don't forget to subscribe i will see you guys in my next video